Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna to be filming a Shein haul for you. So Shein is the brand that I just started using. I've already done one video with them. My last video you all seemed to really love and I went down an absolute treat. And I loved it as well. I was so pleasantly surprised. I really wanted to make another order, see if I could get lucky a second time round. Also just wanted to very quickly say like, thank you so much for all the love on the last Shein haul because I've never received that many messages and that many like lovely comments. I was so overwhelmed. I think at the minute, like when I'm recording this video, it has like 16,000 views, which is mental for me. Um, and I know it's probably small for other people, but it's so much for me. So thank you so much to everyone who has watched it. Um, it means so much much and hello to all the new subscribers as well. One thing that I was continuously kind of asked about in the comment section of that video was about the sizing for Shein. So um, look, there's no kind of way about it. You're gonna have to, like the easiest way to do things, I actually did show it in a vlog that went up. I was When I was making this order, I showed how I do things um, in a vlog. I'll link that somewhere up above. The easiest way to do things is to measure your body. Measure your chest, your waist, your the length of your legs, like every part of your body, just see what it is. I always do things in inches. And then I'll just show you actually on the app. I have the app on my phone, which is dangerous because every time they send me a notification, I'm like, yeah, add that, add that into my wish list as well, please. <laughs> I like this top. This is currently on my wish list. So you can go through down, like you, if you just scroll down a little bit, you will see loads and loads and loads of reviews and you can see like photo reviews. You can see what it looks like on people. You can see like the sizing. It gives you a rating then, like this one would be like 4.7. Also, can we not talk about my nails right now? I'm gonna go get my nails done next week and I cannot wait because at the moment, my nails are covered in tan and I just hate not having hate that they're just completely bare so let's just ignore that yes so that's a 4.7 out of 5 and you can see that most people have said that it is true to size then what you're going to do is you're going to go into um the size chart click in there I always go to inches and see then if your measurements match which one of them they match the closest to um I would always go maybe like a little bit up there has been one or two items that I went a little bit down in and they were actually fine as well so just judge it see what the people in the comments say loads of people do um reviews which is brilliant I actually have done reviews on the website as well because every time you do a review you get points and every point that you get you can it basically takes money off when you're making an order it's actually brilliant I actually love the app the website the brand everything I'm actually obsessed with it yeah I hope that helps with the sizing everything is different it's not like a large in one top is going to be consistent. Every single piece of clothing is different. You're better off just measuring yourself and having a quick look through the size guide. It really doesn't take that much time. It seems like a lot, a lot of effort. It's actually not that bad. Anyways, on with the haul. This is the first outfit. I'm actually like pleasantly surprised. It fits me like pretty much perfectly. Um, I think that, okay, we'll start with the halter top, okay? With the top, obviously I'm not wearing the right type of bra, but this fits absolutely perfectly. Like, I really like this. It's not too short. It gives me a good inch below my bra line. Really, really, really happy with that. And it feels really snug on as well. In terms of the leggings, I have to say, like, I really like them. And um, this isn't something I would typically buy or typically wear, but I really do love them. I actually can't see through them either, which is unreal. They feel really nice. They feel really soft. Very happy with them. They, they don't feel like the most expensive quality leggings ever in the world, but like they're not, so they're not gonna feel like that, you know? But um, I really like them. I love this whole outfit. I feel like this is something you could wear with like heels and go to like a barbecue or go for like, drinks with the gals on a Friday night or something like that. So happy with this whole outfit. I would definitely give this whole outfit, what were we doing last time out of five? I would give this whole outfit, honestly, like a 4.9 out of five. Okay, I'm probably gonna keep these leggings on and just try other tops with it. This is the next top. I really like it. I love the design of it. In case you're wondering why I'm always looking over here, that's where my mirror is. So I'm just trying to like look at it in real life and not just through my viewfinder. But I really do like it. I love the colors of it. I love that it's a bit weird. <laughs> um, I will say the material material doesn't feel like a kind of t-shirt material it feels more like a jersey material but to be honest it's grand like it's really soft it goes to like my hip and I like it I think it's lovely I like where the sleeves hit as well and it's a little bit roomy which I like very impressed I would probably give this a four out of five because I think the material could be a little bit better but I really do like it it's very cute this next top is something that was one of the first things I put in my wish list 
um, when I first went on to Shein and it kept going, it kept um, being out of stock. So I am so excited to have it. I can't wait to try it on. Oh my God, I love it. I love it so much. So it's basically like a knitted crop top, which I'm obsessed with. It has little flowers here. It's a really bright yellow look, very bright. And it's like property V, very nice. Oh my God, I love it so much. It fits perfectly. It was well worth the wait. I think this might be, I know I haven't tried on anything else, but this might be my favorite thing ever that I've had from them. Oh my God, I love it so much. It fits perfectly. I love it. I love it so much. I'm so happy with it. And that's the back of it there as well. Oh my God, obsessed. We'll give this one a five out of five, gorgeous. Of course, I bought neon again. <laughs> I really liked the last neon top that I got. It was like a pink one and I loved it. Um, so I wanted to get more from them because I don't see too much neon like in other stores that much or if it is, it's like outrageously expensive. So I got this one, it has no shoulder this side, which isn't something that I typically go for. It doesn't make me the most comfortable with my arms and stuff like that, but you know what? I actually quite like it. Obviously quite tight, which it needs to be, I suppose, for it to be really kind of stuck to you here. Obviously I've like just to take my bra strap down for this top, but I have to say like, I do really like it. And imagine this with like leather looking pants, with some heels, like, mm, really like it. In terms of length, it's again about like an inch lower than my bra line, which is perfect. I can't remember how much it was, but again, like the last video, I'll put all the prices up as I'm going on the screen. Now, I would probably, to be honest with you, I would probably give this like a three out of five, just because like, it's fine. It's fine. As you can see, it is like a little bit see-through as well. So you'd have to wear the right bra with it. Um, but it's fine. I, I'm not gonna send it back or anything like that, but it's not my favorite, you know? Okay, this next top was also one that I was super excited about and I'm not, 100% sure on it, so please let me know what you think in the comments. So basically it has like, oh, I have to move my hair, don't I? So basically it's like very v-neck, very open <laughs> is the only word I can use for it. It is backless and then it like meets your back halfway down. I'm not sure on this one, girls. I'm really not sure on it. It looked gorgeous in the photos and I think that like, if you don't have, if you have like smaller boobs, then I think it would be nice, but I don't know, I think I'd be too self-conscious the whole time. I feel like I'd need to probably like pin it or something. Um, the one good thing about it is like with the straps, you can tighten the straps as much as you want, which is great, but I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I would probably give this one like, a two out of five because this just is not what I thought it was going to be at all. Even though the reviews in it are very good on the on the app and everything. I think it's just because my chest is a bit bigger, it just isn't really it isn't really for me. And that's fine. But two out of five. <laughs> this is the next top. I really do like it, but it's quite see-through. I feel like I feel like we're not having the best look with this one. I don't know why, but look, I suppose that's the reality of it, isn't it? Some items are gonna be fantastic and some of them probably aren't. So I'd rather show you what's good and what's not. But I do quite like this. I just feel like I'd probably have to wear like a little cami underneath it. You can clearly see my bra through it. Um, but I think it's really cute. I wanted some of these little tops just to wear with like high-waisted jeans at work and stuff like that and just to tuck into skirts and stuff as well. I love the color. It's a gorgeous kind of like baby pastel blue, blue, <laughs> pastel-y blue. It's almost like a bluey purpley kind of color. I do really like it. I like the sleeves on it, but you can definitely see my bra through it. So I think you'd need to wear like a cami underneath. I like the neck of it as well. I think that's kind of cute. Again, this was cheap as chips, but you can see my bra. So I give this one, I think a three out of five as well, just because it's very see-through. Love this top so much. This one has brought it home. Oh my God, do I have this on backwards? No. This one has definitely brought it back for me. Thank God, because I was like, oh my God, if all of these things, I, I was like starting to get like, oh my God, if I don't like these things, it's gonna be so sad. But this one has brought it back for me. The colors in this are so vivid. Oh my goodness, so lovely. I really love the length of it. It's kind of like, like a peplum top. Um, which I really like. I love the material. It's kind of like a shirt material, which is really nice. Love that the sleeves have like extra material in them. Love that so much. Love the design. And then the back of it is like this, which I really like. Oh my God, I didn't tan my back. I've just shown the internet. Don't judge me. <laughs> back on track. 
next is the next t-shirt again because it's white it's a little bit see-through but I kind of expect that with most white t-shirts um but I really like it so basically on it it has like baby pink here baby blue here yellow here here it says goodbye on it across here it says banana I think this would be like a really cute t-shirt to tuck into like high-waisted jeans or to wear with joggers it is quite tight fitting as I said it is kind of like see-through like you can see the pants and everything coming through there um but it's quite cute like if you wore like a cute bra underneath I think it would be nice definitely not wearing the right bra right now um I do like it it's actually like kind of I must check what material it is because it's kind of ah, there's like five percent spandex I was thinking something like that because I just feels like a fitness top but I do really like it I think it's really cute I'm happy with this I would probably give it a three out of five just because I feel like it is quite see-through more so than some of the other things I've gotten from Sheen I feel like all this stuff I've gotten today has been either exactly true to size or teeny bit small I would like this to have like a little bit more room in it I thought this was going to kind of be um a top that was a little bit more I suppose oversized but because of the type of material it is it's not that type of a t-shirt it's not one of those ones that kind of like hangs loose it's um got spandex in it like that's the material so yeah anyways I give it a three out of five because I just think it could have been a much nicer top but I still am happy with it this is the next top I really like it actually I love the design of it I love that it's v-neck it's basically just like you tie it with a little bow here in the middle it is open for like your midriff I suppose um I quite like this personally I probably would put like a little like cami underneath it just because otherwise I don't know your boobs are on show <laughs> um I think it would be really cute for like a barbecue or something like that or if you did want it's actually really cute for like a little beach day or something they could just have like your bikini on under or something like that I do really like it I think that it's really flattering I love the kind of like peplum kind of style to it like it does like kick out you've got kind of like peplum and I do really like that I do really like it overall and I suppose like there's actually not that much of your midriff showing I really like this this gets a full five out of five for me this is exactly what I thought it was going to be the material feels lovely it's a gorgeous fit and I can see myself wearing this a lot so this is a full five out of five for me I really like this I would give this one like a five out of five it's exactly what I thought it was going to be and I love it I can actually see myself wearing this loads <laughs> I don't really know what I was thinking buying this. This is such a like not me type top. I never wear this kind of a turtleneck situation. I'm gonna be so honest. I'm after getting my lipstick on it. I'm so sad and I was trying to put it on. I don't know whether you can see, but like I got my li lipstick on it. I don't know if you can see, but I got my lipstick on it when I was like trying to put it on over my head. Disaster. So I'm gonna have to go and wash this like straight away. I'm gonna wash everything anyways, but like raging I got some lipstick on it now because it's quite difficult to get this over your head and I was trying to be careful to not get makeup on the neck of it but then I got makeup literally right in the middle that was counterproductive <laughs> I'm not a big fan of the neck don't think even if I fixed it I don't think I would really like it other than that like it's a nice length but it's just not me it's just it's just not me and it is see-through as well so this for me like there's not really wrong with the top I just don't really like it so I'd probably give it a 4 out of 5 in terms of quality and stuff I've got some points for the neck of it and the see-throughness of it absolutely raging I got a lipstick on it because now I can't return it so annoying <laughs> this is the next top which I absolutely adore I just think it's so fun I really love the colours of it the like pastel tie-dye type of situation it is a little bit see-through as it most of these things but like it's fine like my hair will always be there anyways so it kind of covers it so it doesn't even make a difference that's how low it is I'd say probably like two to three inches yeah like proper three inches below my bra line which is great it's kind of a longer crop top which is fab I love the color of it so much like I love it the normal round neckline love that the sleeves on it are like pretty much perfectly perfect length for me really really do love that I would give this the full five well no maybe I give it like 4.8 because it is a little bit see-through but because it's like pastel and the type of material it is I kind of expected that exactly how it looks on the website if not even nicer in real life really really like this my goodness I love this top I love it so much this is exactly how it looks on the website this is everything I thought it was gonna be I love it I love it I love it you know what I don't even think this one is that see-through what do you think I don't think it is I think it's really nice it's quite long actually it's way longer than I thought it was going to be um the way I viewed this on the website it was 
tucked into like a a light pink plasticky type skirt like latex skirts and it was gorgeous and I was like oh my god I want that I got the top half of it anyways but I really do like it and it feels really comfortable as well oh I love this this is like a great find now I really do think this is great I love it I just think it's so kind of fun and weird and nice and I like it <laughs> I give this probably a 4.9 out of 5 okay so this top is a little bit smaller than I thought it was going to be and it's also a little bit shorter than I thought it was going to be. So I bought this to wear with a skirt, I had a very specific skirt in mind. You can see it is like a little bit see-through, not very bad but it is kind of noticeable I suppose. I really like the colour of it, I like the neck of it, it's very similar to the other ones where it's kind of like that rolled up kind of effect. I have no idea what the name of it is. But um, yeah, I like that. It's the same on the sleeves. The sleeve length is actually fine. Um, it's just a little bit tight, I feel. And it is shorter than I thought it was going to be in terms of like the crop length. I thought it was going to be like, to, I thought it was going to kind of be like to here on me and it's, it's not. <laughs> so um, yeah. I would probably give this one a three out of five because like it's grand and I will use it and get, I will wear it and get good use out of it, but I was expecting better. This is the next thing that I bought from them. This is surprising to me. This is a completely different material than I thought. I thought it was gonna be like a linen-y type material, but this is actually just like cotton. I'm so surprised. I'm happy because that's a bit more, this is more comfortable. Um, but it's basically like a play suit or in America, I think they call them rompers. But this is what it looks like. I'm not sure on it guys. Please let me know what you think. I'm not sure on it. I love sunflowers, which is why I bought it. And I thought online it looked gorgeous. Um, in real life, it's fine. It's just fine. I think if I'd seen this in store, I probably wouldn't have purchased it. But I do think that something like this will be handy. Hopefully the weather will get better soon and it'll be nice to like wear in the house. But I can't really see me wearing this anywhere else other than like out into the garden unfortunately i do i don't i don't know i think it's just because the short part the shorts like end of it are quite short um and it almost feels like pajamas it doesn't feel like a kind of normal play suit feels it just feels like you know a really cute little like pajamas i might actually wear them as pajamas let me know what you think about it very very unsure about this i'd probably give it a three out of five i feel like most of the items have been like a three out of five Next things that I got were these pants. I just threw this top back on again just to have something to have on the top half of me. But these are like red tartan pants that I got. I almost feel like a jersey material. They're very comfortable. They're quite stretchy. There's a lot of room. I probably could have gotten a size down in these to be honest. Um, but this is what they look like. Um, they are quite tight. I don't know. I think these are the type of things that I wear like on black t-shirt with. I don't know how confident I would feel like my tummy and stuff like that because there's kind of like no support in them. It will show every lump and bump that you got. And absolutely work if that is you and have the confidence for that. But I'm still I'm still working on it. So um yeah, I do really like these. I'm gonna keep these. I don't know how much use I'm really gonna get out of them, but I do like them. I've wanted pants like this for ages. I do think they're a little bit big. I probably could have got a size down in them. They're ever so slightly like wide at the very bottom of like where my ankles are. I wish that they were like properly like stuck to my ankle, but I might take them into the zip yard and get them like um altered i'll see how i go because i kind of like these anyways i might just pin them up or something but no i do i really like these i think they're really nice let's see how they're not that see-through can't see my underwear through them <laughs> gorgeous angles we put up on the internet erin well done <laughs> give them probably a four out of five losing slight points for the fact that they are a tiny bit big on me um, they're a tiny bit long on me. I wish they were a little bit more fitted and I wish they were a little bit better quality. But overall, really, really like them. This is the next item, which is a skirt. I absolutely love it. It's this gorgeous kind of cow print design. I absolutely love it. I have a thing for like this, like these midi skirts that have a split. I just think they're gorgeous. Um, but yeah, I really like this. My one thing with this is that it does not go up properly on me. It's still a little bit open at the back. 
it's a little bit small and I think from my last haul I should have known skirt waists are quite small so I definitely would have sized up in this one had I known had I like remembered that so that is just something to remember if you're ordering any skirts go up in the waist size no matter what go up in the waist size because this shit is tight I nearly just tuck it in and wouldn't worry about it leave it half opened to be honest with you <laughs> I really like it I think it's really cute um, and I love the little slit in it as well, like it's so cute. It's like a very nice length as well, I don't know whether you can see. But it is a really nice length and it's very flowy. It's very loose as well. I actually, I'm actually, actually obsessed with this. This is one of my favourite pieces, this haul. Absolutely love this. Also meant to show you this from Shein, almost forgot. It's like a lingerie bodysuit. Obsessed. It's beautiful. Like I don't know if you can kind of see the detail on it but like, it's actually so pretty. I might just try and find the picture and um, put it up on the screen, but it's gorgeous. Absolutely obsessed. That's all the clothes that I got, but I did get like three little accessories. I said I'd show you those as well. So I got two necklaces and I got one belt. So I'll show you the belt first. This is the belt. I think it's absolutely gorgeous. It's like a gorgeous red velvet and like, it's just a normal, oh my God, look how pretty that is. And then it's just a normal kind of like, gold um, buckle belt on it. I love the colour though and it feels lovely. To be fair, the inside of it does feel very plasticky. Love how that looks, gorgeous. That'd be so nice around Christmas time, so nice. Try some necklaces. Oh, I hate that my bra's there. This is the first one. Absolutely gorgeous. I absolutely love it. I love these kind of like really small dainty necklaces. I think they're just the cutest thing ever. I've gotten notes from Betty and Biddy recently um, and I love them too. I'm just gonna put this on and just see what it's like. I really like the length of that. I think it's really nice. Very cute. Okay, the last one then. This is the second one. So it has like a longer like black stone and then it has like a little moon. How nice is that? Oh my God, so cute. I'm gonna try it on because the neck of it, the length of the chain seems really short. So I'm just gonna move it up to the last one and I'm gonna try it on as well. Oh, nice. I really like it. Lovely like length as well. Really like these. Oh my goodness, can't cope. Very happy with these. Would definitely order more. Really like that. I guess this is the end of the haul. Thank you so much for watching. I suppose this time I didn't have as great luck as I did in the first haul, but I have still found really nice pieces. I, yeah, I feel like I have some really nice bits in it. There are kind of quite a few things that I would probably return. I don't know whether I still can return or because these have been here for quite a while now, probably like two weeks and as well as that like how do you even return I have no idea I need to look that whole process up after having this haul I feel like I got quite lucky on the first one um but in saying that I got some really really nice pieces this time as well and I am really happy with the things that I have I think it really just goes to show with Shein that there's a lot of different items that are great quality and some other items that are not so great quality I would very much liken them to the likes of pennies where some things are absolutely brilliant and some things are absolutely crap <laughs> but in general I really like Shein I already know I'm gonna make another order so I really hope you liked the video let me know down below what you thought of the items and I will talk to you very very soon in my next video bye guys